Okay, I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say it right now. As much as I'm part of Exile and they went on their bootcamp, my honest opinion, I think the... I personally think the Korean bootcamp is kind of useless. Um, I think the only reason Korean bootcamp is good is because of the solo queue right now. I think the scrim practice is useless. Um, I think it's like, in terms of a business standpoint, to spend that much money, or however much it is, to send all your players there, pay for all the logistics and stuff like this, it's not that good to go on a Korean bootcamp. Because I, for one, I think my whole logic is flawed if you can scrim these three teams. If you can scrim these three teams, it's probably maybe worth in the long run. The biggest reason is because 12, 10 changes are going to be so big, in my opinion, that the game is going to change completely. So that everything you learn as a team is probably going to have to be reevaluated on the spot. I think the only thing you can learn in a Korean bootcamp is mechanics. And that's why I think that the only reason going on a Korean bootcamp is good is for, is for solo queue. And if that's what they go for, sure. Solo queue will help. You'll get better at the game mechanics. Will you get better as a team in scrimming? X for doubt, in my opinion. Just because of this change that's coming. If there was no big patch here, and it was going to be a similar patch to Summer, then I would get a Korean bootcamp. Like last year, I remember the jungle meta at MSI was like Rumble, Morgana, uh, Lilia, something like this. Hecarim, I think. Udyr was slowly falling out. And going into a Korean bootcamp there, and then going into Summer, the meta was kind of similar. Right? The game didn't change that much. The meta was similar-ish in the first two to three weeks. But I think Korean Bootcamp is a bit of a meme to get better as a team when this patch is going to hit.